Good morning, good morning, good morning. Happy Monday and welcome back to a new day of learning. Let's start with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Royal Pledge. I will respect myself and others, offer kindness, act with integrity and remember to persevere. Well, happy Monday, everybody. Hope you had a great weekend and you got to do something fun. This week, we are going to talk about days in history. So what happened on this day in history? And then we're going to learn something interesting and something we didn't already know. So today's May the 10th. Today in history on May the 10th in 1960, the USS Nautilus circumnavigated the globe, submerged for the first time ever, the first vessel ever to do that. What does that mean? Well, first of all, the USS Nautilus was a submarine. So submerged means underwater. And then to circumnavigate the globe, they went the whole way around. That's a pretty cool thing. The first time that had ever been done. The USS Nautilus was the world's first operational nuclear-powered submarine. And the first submarine to complete a submerged transit of the North Pole. And submerged, remember, means underwater. And don't forget that today in history... It was the first vessel to circumnavigate the globe underwater. That's a pretty cool thing. Could you imagine being the person that developed or came up with the idea of submarines? Pretty cool, right? And then to be working on that project, to make it come to be a real thing. How much perseverance that took. How much hard work. And I bet there are many times that it went wrong. And yet people persevered to create a vessel that could go underwater, the submarine. And then on May the 10th, 1960, circumnavigated the globe. Sub, uh, <laughs> um, submerged. Couldn't get my words out then. That's a pretty cool thing. And what a fun thing to learn. I didn't know that. I think learning is a wonderful thing. It might be a small fact, but it's something that you could share with somebody else. And that's the good thing about learning. It doesn't always have to be school-related things. Learning is any time you learn something new. And that was a new fact. It was new for me. I hope it was new for you too. So take every opportunity to learn as much as you can and always keep learning. This week will be what happened in history on this day. Who knows what we're going to find out? Let's see what happens. Today, we learned about the USS Nautilus um, circumnavigating the globe, submerged on May 10th, 1960. So that is our first what happened in history. This week we'll be finding out something new. I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. A small fun fact. Let's make sure we're taking every opportunity to learn because every day is a great day to learn. So learn as much as you can, never stop learning. When you think you're done learning, guess what? There's always more to learn, so keep learning. Today is a great day to be kind. Remember to use your kind words, kind actions, and just spread kindness everywhere you go. No matter what happens, no matter what you do, just be kind. Today is a great day to be the best you can be. Make sure you are always working hard, believing in yourself, persevering, because you know what? You can be anything you want when you do those things, and you can lead to great things. Speaking of great things, like we said before, imagine the people that invented, created, and came up with the idea of a submarine and then made it happen. They had to persevere, because imagine saying, hey, I have an idea, what about an underwater vessel? People say, that's I'm silly. But they persevered, they believed in themselves, and they created it, and now submarines are used all over the world. Make sure you are doing great things every day by being the best you can be. And then if you make a mistake, it's okay. It's part of learning, but also make sure you take responsibility, fix it and move on. I hope you will have a wonderful Monday. I hope you have a great week. And as always, remember, be kind, be kind, be kind some more. Have a magnificent Monday.